Jodhpur. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the CEO of Senate Business Solutions, Mr. Sampa Jaya Sundara to the stage. Thank you very much for giving me this opportunity to speak to you all. Wonderful uh, evening to all of you. Um, once again, uh, award winners, congratulations to all and other participants. So IT, ICT industry is very uh, challenging industry, you all know, and uh, that is the industry for future as well. Uh, as a SASCOM uh, director, I quickly briefed about the Sri Lanka situation and even uh, way forward in our industry. So uh, we are in the process of building a $5 billion industry. So it is um, last recorded figure was 1.7 billion. From there, like, you know, how best we can take the industry into 5 billion dollars. It's a tough task and it's a good task. Because uh, our industry, when you build 5 billion dollars, it remains within the country. There's no um, raw material purchase or whatever. So we can enjoy that 5 billion dollars. So that's a problem. But to do that, it's a huge ask because we have to build resource pool. And with the current uh, challenges we all are facing with the migration and various other challenges, so we have to increase our numbers. So, uh, <coughs> industry level, we have 125,000 people working in industry, direct employment, and of course, another good set of employees indirect working for other companies. So, how fast we can build that uh, uh, 125,000 number into 200,000 and 250,000. So that's a requirement. So we all are working really hard. The institutions, uh, private education institutes, uh, universities, we are working really hard to build that workforce. So, so we are launching another program in this year to increase the workforce sudden quick time, like nine months period, how best we can produce more resources for the country uh, for all of us to thrive. So uh, uh, that's about the industry level, like you know, the, the challenges. So, um, company point of view, uh, this is a journey like, you know, some part of this uh, business for the last uh, 20 plus years. So, it's not that easy, like, you know, taking a Sri Lankan company global. So, at the moment, we are operating in 40 countries. We have deployed our systems in 40 countries, 1,400 pounds in two main regions, Asia, as well as MIA region, Middle East and uh, Africa. So, uh, uh, young entrepreneurs here, like, you know, there are award winners, uh, from IT sector as well. So uh, don't get scared. So you can go out. Sri Lankan companies can go out. We produce our best team. We produce best cricketers. We produce best software. We all know like, you know, world uh, best run stock exchanges run by Sri Lankan systems developed in Sri Lanka. Some of the ERPs developed in Sri Lanka. My product used by few government organizations in the globe. So we can. So you have to first believe that you can. And, and, and we have to get everyone together around you and do this. So that is very important. So without taking our local products, local talents to overseas market, I don't think we can win this game. We all have to work together uh, to win this game. Same time, uh, it's important to work with your team, encourage them almost daily basis, work with them, build empathy uh, and guide them what to do and how to do to take the products globally. Um, finally, we are going through very challenging times and interesting times. Uh, so uh, my request is build empathy around whoever around you, your office colleagues, your subordinates, your family members, your extended family members, your neighborhood, plus whoever you can and support them. Because less, we might get the big salaries like you know, us sitting, but many who can't afford even uh, daily living. So if we look after them, we, we can come out strongly as a team. So that, that is my message for the community because it's very important for us to survive uh, not only as individuals but as a community. So once again, thank you very much for giving me this wonderful opportunity. Uh, let's try it together. Um, within a couple of years, we can celebrate a better. Thank you.